Welcome back to my channel, Math and Language, and we're going to discuss how to divide fractions, next number to proper fraction, and vice versa. So let's have the first example. We have 3 and a half divided by 2 thirds. So for this one, you have to change the mixed number to an improper fraction first. So 2 times 3, that will be 6 plus 1, that will be 7 over 2. Now, for this one, divided by 2 thirds, you will get the reciprocal of the divisor, which is 2 thirds. So if you're, you're going to get the reciprocal, you just have to switch it or swap. The numerator will become the denominator, and the denominator will become the numerator, like so. And for the division sign, it will now become a multiplication sign or times. Now, we can easily multiply it 7 times that will be 21 and 2 times 2 that will be 4 now for this one um, this is already the final answer we can't reduce it to lowest term but some of your teachers will ask you to find sorry to change it to a mixed number they don't like improper fractions some of the teachers okay so let's change it to next number 21 divided by 4 will be 5 5 times 4, 20. We have 1 here. And remainder 1. Remember, okay, I'll just change the color so you won't be confused. Remember the quotient, that will be the whole number. 4 will be 5. And the remainder, that will be the numerator. And the divisor, that will be the denominator. And for the question three and a half divided by two thirds, that will be five and one third. Okay, let's move on to the next example. What if we have five and two fifths divided by three fourths? Again, you have to change the mixed number to an improper fraction. So that will be five times five, 25 plus two will be 27 over five. Divided by, sorry, we have to change the divisor to the, uh, we have to get the reciprocal. So, reciprocal of 3 fourths, that will be 4 thirds. And change the division sign to multiplication. Now, let's multiply it. But if you can reduce it, eh, uh, if you can reduce it now, it's much better, like 27 and 3. So we can divide both of them by 3. So 3 divided by 1, that will be... 3 divided by 3, that will be 1. And 27 divided by 3, that will be 9. 9 times... So we can now multiply. 9 times 4, that will be 36. So And 5 times 1, that will be 5. Now let's also change it to... Uh, mix number 6 divided by 5. How many 5s are there in... 36, so that will be 7. 7 times 5, that will be 35. 36 minus 35, that will be 1. And we have a remainder here. 7 remainder 1. Okay. Now again, the, the quotient, that will be the whole number. The remainder, that will be the numerator. And the divisor, that will be the denominator. So for the question 5 and 2 fifths divided by 3 fourths, the answer will be 36 over 5 or 7 and 1 fifth. Let's have the final example. What if we have the proper fraction as a dividend and the divisor will be a mixed number? So as usual, for mixed numbers, you have to change it first to an improper fraction. So 7 times 3, that will be 21. Plus 1 will be 22. And copy the denominator. Now, uh, let's just copy paste this one first. Now, let's get the reciprocal of the divisor, which is 22 over 7. That will be 7 over 22. And just copy the dividend. Remember, if you all get the reciprocal, you will change the division sign to a multiplication sign which is times and as much as possible if you could reduce it like this one 
22 and 2, you can divide both of them by 2. That will be 1 and 11 here. So 1 times 7, that will be 7. 5 times 11, that will be 45. And since this is a proper fraction, you cannot change it to a mixed number. And this is already the final answer. For the question 2 fifth divided by 3 and 1 7, you'll get 7 over 55. And that's the end of the lesson on how to divide fractions, mixed number to proper fraction and vice versa. If you have questions or in need of clarifications, please comment down or if you have suggestions also. Again, this is James, your math and language instructor. Please like and subscribe and also click the bell notification so you will be updated on my future videos about math and language. I'll see you again. Thank you. Bye.